Icelandic national costume, collectively known in Icelandic as Jobuningorin has enjoyed various levels of popularity since the term was coined in Iceland in the 19th century, during the struggle for independence. Since 2001 the national costume is regulated by Jobuningara the National Costume Authority, which preserves the correct techniques of making them and instructs people. <laughs> <laughs> Women's costume. The five following types of costume are all recognized as Icelandic national costumes. However both the kirtle and skotbunningor were designed in the 19th century from scratch as ceremonial costumes, while the faldbunningor, paisafot and the upflutor are traditional daily wear of Icelandic women in olden times. Faldbunningor <inaudible> 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 The faldbunningor is an older type of costume worn by women since at least the 17th century and well into the 19th. In its most recognized form it incorporated a hat decorated with a curved sheet-like ornament protruding into the air and exists in two variants. One of which is the croakfalder and the other is the spafalder. Previously a large hat decorated with gold wire bands was worn with it, as well as ruff which is the reason for the faldbunningor's wide collar, which was designed to support it. Later, around the start of the 18th century women started to wear the much simpler tail cap with it. Paisafot The paisafot are black woolen clothes commonly worn by women in the 18-19th century. They usually consisted of a twill skirt and a jacket of fine knitted woolen yarn with a black tail cap. It is believed that this costume was invented when women, desiring simpler working clothes than the faldbunningor, started to use male articles of clothing. This includes both the tail cap and the peza which originally was a jacket with a single row of buttons, but evolved into this costume and eventually discarded with the buttons. Upflutor <inaudible> 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 The upflutor is a woman's costume, consisting of bodice that can be colored in bright colors such as red or blue, but often black. Its headpiece is a tail cap. The costume is basically the undergarment of the faldbunningor which evolved into a costume of its own right. Kirtle The kirtle is a costume for women, designed by the artist Sigurer Gummensen in the 19th century. It was designed to look like Viking Age costumes. It however incorporates a hat similar to the one on the Skotbunningor. While Sigurer's vision of the Viking Age costume remains popular, costumes designed to more closely resemble archaeological finds have gained some popularity as well. Skotbunningor. The Skotbunningor was also designed by Sigurer Gummensen. It was conceived as a modernized variation of the Faldbunningor, which had fallen out of use by the middle of the 19th century. It incorporates a complicated hat inspired by the ones traditionally used with the Faldbunningor. <laughs> <laughs> Men's costume Bunningor Karla or the men's costume exists in three or four radically different versions. The Jobunningor Karla is the only direct descendant of traditional daily wear of Icelandic men, while the other were designed from the start as ceremonial costume. <laughs> Jobunningor Karla The one considered most traditional consists of woolen breeches or trousers, a usually double-buttoned vest and a double-buttoned jacket called treya. Sometimes a peza with a single row of buttons is used in lieu of the vest and treya. On the head is a tail cap, though historically different hats were also used. This costume was usually black, navy blue or dark green, although the vest, which was usually brighter was sometimes red, some regions stood out, using white wool instead of the darker colors. It is identical to the clothing Icelandic men commonly wore from the 17th until the 19th century. Topic: 
In the middle of the 19th century, when many Icelandic men had taken to using continental clothing, Sigurður Gummensson, an Icelandic artist, designed a costume for men which closely resembles 10th century Nordic clothing. While it attained some popularity at the time, it eventually disappeared until at the end of the 20th century when Viking culture and traditions have enjoyed increased popularity. <laughs> Although not a traditional costume, the Hattiarbuningor was conceived as a modernized version of the men's traditional national costume and is frequently worn instead of a tuxedo to formal events. It is the result of a competition for an updated i.e., more pragmatic version of the men's national costume held in 1994 in correlation with the 50th anniversary of Iceland's independence from Denmark and the establishment of the Republic. Some have critiqued the design of the Hattiarbuningor, claiming that it bears greater resemblance to the Faroese national costume in its styling. Regardless, the Hattiarbuningor continues to enjoy widespread popularity among Icelanders. The fourth costume Sigurður Gummensson also designed another costume in the middle of the 19th century, which was commonly worn by students. It consisted of a black jacket, white shirt and black knee breeches with horizontally striped or solid colored white socks. <laughs> Children's costumes The Bunningor Barna or the children's costumes did not differ from the adults' version except in size until the 20th century, when girls were given shorter skirts. Shoes Although today, modern shoes are often used with the national costumes, traditionally shoes made of either fish or sheep skin, with woolen inlets, were worn with the costumes. These shoes are known as Roscor and Soskinscore respectively. Some people also use 18th or 19th century type leather shoes with buckles similar to the footwear commonly used with the Faroese and Norwegian national costumes. Usage In olden times these clothes, except the Skotbuningor, Kirtle and Hattiarbuningor, were worn daily by people of all ages and classes. Today they are worn by many on ceremonial occasions such as the National Day, birthdays and weddings. See also Lopepesa Bunad Topic Notes Topic External Links Bunningoran.is, official website of Joe Bunningara, the National Costume Authority Upflutur.is, website of the Joe Bunningastafen, National Costume House in Icelandic BB is three pictures of Icelandic national costumes in Icelandic National Museum of Iceland in Icelandic <laughs>